Hello, and welcome back to another episode of TM3 Life. So on our last episode, we went ahead and we uh, installed and wired this beautiful Tesla high power wall connector. And uh, so now we just gotta test it out. So all we gotta do is grab the wand and, uh, oh yeah, we gotta plug it into a Tesla. And I don't have my Model 3 yet. Oh, what to do? I have an idea. Bring in the Model S. Okay, so here we go with the first attempt at charging with the new HPWC. We're going to go ahead and uh, attempt to use the button on the wand, which is actually one of the uh, advantages of having HPWC. You actually don't have to touch the charge port. You can just hit the button on the wand and hopefully the charge port door will open for you. So let's give it a shot. There we go. Alright, we are white, we're ready. Blue and green pulsing light. As you can see on the HPWC, when you are charging, the green light actually pulsates, kind of like Knight Rider. And of course, on the vehicle itself, we have the typical blinking green light. There we go, folks. Rainbow Road activated in the charge port. Awesome. Okay, so here we are charging in the Tesla Model S. And currently we're at 26 miles an hour of charging, 40 amps, 238, 39 volts changes here and there. Not too bad of a drop from the 240 that we're supplying. So, it looks like so far, so this will be a good test. We're going to go ahead and test the temperatures um, at the charging station and also at the breaker panel. Okay, so today we we're able to confirm that the HPWC does in fact uh, charge a Tesla. And uh, in fact, we ended up uh, getting upwards of 28 miles per hour um, for our charge rate. And uh, it was a very successful, successful endeavor. Uh, I do want to thank our fellow Tesla owner and Model 3 reservation holder for coming all this way to test out my personal HPWC. So big thanks goes out to you and to everyone else. Well, this is TM3 Life. Catch you next time.